All right, guys, I'm gonna show you how to build this pole barn in under 20 minutes. I have no experience whatsoever. Let's build. Let's build a freaking barn. Holy cow, this is gonna be a big project by myself. Level here, which actually that's really dang good. All right guys, I let it dry overnight. Now it's time to take all of the uh, bracing off and continue with the post. accurate the uh, 10 foot boards are I'm pulling a tape right now and you guys can see it lands right in the middle at 10 foot You guys will see the framing go up uh, in the morning when all of this dries. We need to make some doors on each little stall. So let's do that. All right guys, I put a screw up over there so when I hold the board up, it'll be something to hold on to since I'm by myself. Again. So, as some of you may have guessed, where the 4x4 posts are, those are going to be doors going in. At first I thought maybe I uh, bit off more than I could chew with this, but I'm so excited with the way it's coming out. It is lower in the back. Solution to that problem. And then also, uh, we're going to have rain catchment and everything on this. Everything on here is going to serve a purpose, and I'm pumped.
as you guys could tell, just go through and cut the uh, uh, extra boards off here in the middle. And then you got a doorway. Holy cow guys, I'm tired. We got about 30 minutes of sun left, but look at that guys. Uh, I am just very, very happy with it. I use these two boards to get the exact measurement I need. All right, for the first time in a long time, the sun's out. Now I gotta take this hoodie off. It's just getting too freaking hot. It's getting colder and colder. I threw my bibs on. It's supposed to be snowing soon.
it's actually warming up the sun's coming out I know I do things different than uh, the conventional way y'all should know that by now if you watch my stuff but uh, now that I have everything I locked in the uh, bottom of this with the two by fours and I locked in the top I got it all down so now I'm gonna go in with nails and I'm gonna nail in everything and then I'm gonna put in my bracing then I'll go back with more two by fours and brace the top and then this will be ready for metal board in the middle that I put up here we're gonna put these brackets on there to hold the middle beam all the way across Putting all these rails all the way around so from the inside if the animals try to push on the metal it won't push through the metal and also out here if they push metal uh, will be uh, bumped up against this so it's just a little bit of extra support don't really need it other than just protection from the animals pushing against it <laughs>
All right, guys, you ready to see it? Boomage, guys, we have a barn. Oh my gosh, it took me a little while to do it because of the weather. We had sleet, rain, snow, sun, everything hit. It's about to start snowing again right now, but got it finished up. We're gonna do a full tour on this in the next video or so. We'll show you guys the inside, how we're gonna lay it, everything out, how we're gonna put all the different pins, uh, rain catchment, how we're gonna feed, all of that stuff. So guys, you wanna stick around. Appreciate you watching. If you haven't, hit that subscribe button notification bell but guys pole barn under 20 minutes pretty freaking pumped